George Galloway demolishes Nicola Sturgeon over unhinged English pub ban Nicola Sturgeon has been branded unhinged by pro-union politician George Galloway after urging English people not to crowd into Scottish pubs and restaurants. Restricted indoor hospitality will reopen in Scotland on Monday, three weeks before England. However, the SNP leader caused controversy when she told English visitors not to sort of crowd into places. She said, from Monday for a period until the middle of May actually there will be more hospitality open in Scotland than in England because there will be some indoor opening, albeit very restricted, that's not the case yet in England. So again if people are coming north across the border, you know, don't sort of crowd into places, you shouldn't be allowed to crowd into places indoors. Don't come specifically to sort of escape the rules in your own area. Mr Galloway hit back, suggesting the nationalist leader was undermining Scotland's tourism industry. On Twitter, he addressed Visit Scotland, the Scottish government's official tourist board. He commented, Dear Visit Scotland does Sturgeon's frankly unhinged self-disfiguration call for English visitors not to visit our pubs and cafes have your endorsement? Asking for 55 million friends. Mr Galloway is the founder of All for Unity, a new unionist party which is standing in next month's Scottish Parliament elections. All for Unity is urging its supporters to vote for the pro-union party best placed to beat the SNP on the constituency list, then for it on the regional list. However, Scottish Conservatives have claimed this could increase the number of nationalist MSPs elected by splitting the unionist vote. Mr Galloway's tweet received over 550 retweets and 2,000 likes. Scots go to the polls next month to elect their next parliament. Ms Sturgeon is demanding another referendum on taking Scotland out of the UK. In 2014 Scotland voted to remain part of Britain by 55% of the vote to 45%. Boris Johnson has ruled out another poll arguing the focus should be on Scotland's coronavirus recovery. Some SNP figures have suggested they could hold a Catalonia-style, wildcat referendum without the British government's consent. However, if this happens Scottish Conservative leader Douglas Ross is urging unionists to boycott the vote. A survey for The Times found 53% of Scots now support the union versus 47% who want to leave. It also suggested the SNP could fall short of an absolute majority in the upcoming elections.